Let's just go in and see what happens. I don't really care because at this point the draft is somewhat useless. As we're probably not going to go for that much longer. Oh, look at that. Medium franchise, Horkoff. From 11 to 1 to get a medium franchise. Well then. Anyway, let's uh, sim to pick 30, which is us. Ta-da. And let's... Oh, we can call a timeout. Let's call a timeout. Yeah. I'm going to try to propose a trade if I can. Offer trade. For the first. Who wants it? Does anybody want our first? Uh, draft picks. First round. It really doesn't have that much value, truthfully. They want to get rid of Barrett Hayton. What's that guy all about? Um, wait, what? He was here a minute ago. Is it... Is he not? Barrett Hayton, he's on the block. Did his overall drop miserably? Or does he have... Oh, okay, yep. He is just all the way down here. Probably because he's 86 overall making 9 million. But it's about to expire. So we could pretty much just steal him, it looks like. But I don't know if I want to do that. Oh, who can we trade this pick to? Goudreau's on the block, but he's probably getting up there in age at this point. They want to get rid of their first. Let's just see if there's any, like, good players that we can get the signing rights to at all. No, no one there. Nuge? Nah. Nope. Nope. Uh, Nico is still here, eh? 12 million. I'm kind of tempted. To try and get Nico. Uh, Dvorak. How many years does he have left on that deal? Oh, seven at 12 point. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Dvorak. No. Not really interested. New Jersey. Nope. Nuh-uh. I feel like there's not going to be a whole lot here, to be honest. I mean, we could try to get he sure and just trade him for something else. Or keep him and just have, like, the nastiest team in the history of the world. And hope that we can finally get something done with that team. You know what? I am going to try it. Screw this. We have a bit of cap space. If we have to move someone, so be it. I'll get rid of Robert Thomas. Guy's making like 4.6 at 83 overall. We can replace him with someone at the end of the year. And we just barely don't have the cap for it. But I mean, it's pretty much there. Uh, skaters matching the block. Who do you want? I can give you... Actually, whose contracts are running up? So we have Zabinijad. Oh, no. And Bouchard. Oh, no. Bouchard's up to 88 overall. Holy crap. Okay, you know what? I'm not going to do this. I'm not. Nope. Mm -mm. No siree. I refuse. I want to try and find, like, a prospect, maybe, if anything. But it doesn't look like anyone's giving those up right now. Oh, you know what? Carolina has a medium elite player here. I mean, the value isn't quite there. I'll try it. Just, they don't even want the pick, but I could just try it. Or, try to sweeten it up a bit. We're getting a medium elite. I could give up on Musty. You know? Uh, Kavanaugh's actually at 85. Like, our team is so good, man. I don't understand. Our team is so good. Ah, oh, well. We are going to be getting rid of Connor Brown, which is like a $3 million cap bump. Cap free. Cap freedom. Cap... <laughs> adjustment in our favor. I don't know what to call it. But anyway, we'll be getting three more million dollars, which is nice. Um, Musty. How'd this guy do for us? Oh, he played in the AHL again this year, didn't he? Am I kind of ruining him? I probably am. 48 points. Okay. Yeah, I'm willing to give up Musty. I got him a while ago, and it's just things aren't working out between us. Uh, is that going to be considered a steal? He's a medium elite. I mean, I feel like this won't even go through. If it does, and they say... Haha, <laughs> you're an idiot? Then I hate this game. Trade rejected. Okay. That's <laughs> sort of what I expected, to be honest. Uh, do we have anyone else I can give up? Those are all two-way contracts. They actually want McCabe, who's on a pretty good deal, though. Uh, Suzuki. Yeah, I've basically ruined this guy. You could have him, too. I'm pretty sure we got him from you, so you can have him back. Still no. Have another crack at it, eh? Hmm. What about... Draft picks. I'll throw in a fourth, too, because screw this draft. Trade accepted. Okay, we just got a medium elite player. Nice. Whether or not he actually gets used, entirely different question. So, let's sim to our pick. And I'm just doing scouting on the fly here. They want us to grab this guy. Ooh, a medium starter guaranteed. That's promising. Is there any gem or busts? 
that I should pin. Okay, yeah. Can I can I pin them now? I can. So 80 and 187. I doubt we'll be able to get this guy. But we should be able to get like we're at 63 already. But the medium starter is pretty nice. And then this guy as well. Do we have any guaranteed abilities here that I should Okay, let me do my scouting and then I'll come back to you guys. You know what, guys? I'm so done with the draft at this point that <laughs> I'm just gonna make some real risky plays. It says this goalie isn't gonna be ready for five years. I know he could be trading bait or whatever, but I think we have enough of that. So I'm gonna try for this guy. Mostly because it says he's three years till NHL ready. Um, Well-rounded personality mess messes. I can't even speak anymore. I'm just so flustered that we lost. Anyway, uh, Joffrey Fitz. Let's see if you fits the team. Okay, I'll take that. There we go. Left wing power forward, 62 overall. Low elite, not bad. Let's sim to our next pick. Pick 92. So that other guy that we had pinned, if I sort by the pins, yeah, he's not going for a bit. So, uh, 187. I'll probably take him a little bit early just because why not? But uh, let's sort by potential again here. Oh, he's not supposed to go to 125, but I don't care. There you go. Five years till NHL ready. Easy peasy. Welcome to the team, kid. Medium elite. <laughs> Center playmaker. Yeah. Drafting is fun. All right. Round... Wait. Did we have two third round picks? We did. Okay. I don't know how or when that happened, but I will take it. Sort by potential. Um, maybe a medium elite goalie? I mean, I really doubt it, but again, I'm still kind of down to take some risks right here. I feel like he's absolutely not going to be. But they're pretty sure, which means he probably won't fall too far, you know? I'm thinking. Okay, this guy's supposed to go at, like, 180 range, 190. So our next pick will be round four. Does it tell me which pick it is? Oh, wait. It's only 96th right now. So I'll just take him next round no matter what. And I think I'm going to risk it for the biscuit with that goalie right now. Just because we can. Here we go. And, yeah, you. Frederick. He's five years till NHL ready. He's definitely not a medium elite, but I'm going to draft him anyway. He ends up being a medium elite. <laughs> All right. Great. Sim to next pick. Round five. Oh, he might be gone. I thought I, for I totally forgot. 162. Actually, this would be prime time. He might still be there. Pin? Yes, he's still there. All right, Nicholas Ramsey. Let's see if you actually are a gem or not. He is a low elite. <laughs> oh, this draft's going pretty good. I haven't even been checking to see if any of these players have abilities. I mean, I really doubt it, but let's go have a look. At Actually, I'm curious to see who Carolina got in our spot first. So Carolina, um, medium top six. Yeah, I'm not too upset about that. And then we have, okay, a low elite, G fits. Actually, you know what, though? I'm wondering if I should separate these into two videos, because then you guys are basically going to know that we lost <laughs> based on when this goes up, you know? Because it's going to be like, oh, 20 minutes. There's no way they made it in. I'll, like, upload them the same night, but, you know, one shortly after the other. So that way it doesn't ruin it kind of thing. Anyway, let's send to our next pick. This has been a um, this has been a decent draft, you know? Medium backup goalie. That's not bad at all. And... Anything here? Oh, ankle breaker. Might be an ankle breaker. I'm not even looking at anything right now. I'm kind of just winging it. And uh, to be fair, it's going quite well. Medium top four. And uh, low top nine. Low top nine's pretty good. But I'm feeling risky. We've already got our fair share of picks. Our fair share of solid picks. I think it's time that... I ruined that. Uh, the Ukrainian boy. Now I have to do it. There you go. Let's pick him up. And he ends up being a medium bottom six. I'm not upset about that, really. We need some depth, you know? Some depth prospects. Maybe it'll turn out to be an actual medium bottom six. Okay. What can we do here now? That is the real question. Bobby. From the Barry... Mmm. No. Okay, let's... Uh... Just scroll down. Try to get a freebie here. Uh, medium top nine. Odds he's actually medium top nine. I'm going to say highly unlikely. But I thought the same thing for the elites that we've drafted. So what do I know? You know? Anyone have three years 
and is like pretty confident about it. No, no, doesn't look like it. This guy, oh, this guy was guaranteed to be four years, it looks like, yeah. Screw it, let's just see what happens. He's gonna be a low bottom six. All right, well, you know what? Overall, decent draft. Okay, Zabenijad, let's see what you want. How much money do we have to spend here? $21 million, so we're gonna have nothing for free agency, essentially. I know you can do the whole multiply thing again, but I'm just gonna kinda go off the top here. So that was a lot of money. New Hook wants a lot of money. I'm not just willing to let these guys walk. Like, we can sign them to deals that, you know, if we don't think they're good, we can just let them go. Uh, ooh. That's, I might actually take him up on that as a depth floor, but we could probably just get someone else in free agency. So, yeah, maybe not. McCabe, how much do you want this time? Yeah. Uh, no. Addison wants... Mm, no, I'll let you walk. I'll wait till the uh, end of year free agency and pick up some players. Yeah, you're worth a million bucks. I'll I'll give you that and see if anything ends up working out. Suzuki wants a two-way deal, so I'll give you that. Force back at Carlson wants a two-way deal. Easy peasy. Dal Cole wants a two-way deal. And Pierlini, what do you want? He wants a two-way deal. All right, nice. Very nice. And if you want... Oh, he doesn't even want to resign, so I'm not going to try it. Hosang, two-way contract. Hagel... Two-way contract. You guys are just so easy to work with. Look at you go. Yeah, nice. Our HL team, probably going to be pretty good again. I don't know. Well, we do have some prospects to throw down there. Granlund, he wants. Okay, yeah, that works for me. Bohinski, medium top four. Sure, there you go. Give you that. Um, Stranges, I know that this guy is, you know, pretty good. Oh my goodness, his potential... <laughs> Low AHL top six. I'm just going to let him walk at this point. I'm basically giving up. Uh, Evans. Nice overall. When when did we draft this guy? 2026? Huh. Well, I'm definitely not letting you go. So I'll give you that contract. Did he have abilities? No. And... I'm not letting you go either, but I have another year to sign you. So I'll leave you be for now. And low top nine, doesn't hurt. There you go. Oops. I guess I should check on the goalies as well. Medium top six forward, not letting you just walk. And medium top nine forward, same situation. Okay, these guys were all good on. If I go to the goalies, how many contract spots do we have left? Oh my goodness. That's not good. <laughs> I think I've offered too many. E. Wow. All right. Well, maybe I should have let some of those guys walk. Hopefully, it prioritizes the more important players because otherwise, we're in a a tough situation. Unless the two-way contracts don't count, do they? They probably do. But yeah, because fifty. Oh boy. I think I uh, I think I did an oopsie here, guys. Ooh. Okay. Well, let's look at the goalies. At least we're good for these two. Um, I mean, what kind of contract do you want? Yeah, all right. <laughs> Just offer another one. Okay, let's advance today and see what happens here. It was an easy decision, so we got to Benajad. Hagel said no. New hook, we got him. We got this guy. Um, Pierlini, so many players competing. Okay, so he doesn't want it. Although, okay, I'll let Suzuki walk as well. We got that guy. Yep. Nice. And nice. It's been a dream of mine. Okay. So basically, I'm just going to look and double check to make sure that all the players that we really care about got signed. And the ones that said no, I don't really care about. You know, if it's like an AHL player, obviously... Oh, we're trying to compete for a position here. Yeah, right. Okay, Robert Thomas has probably got to go. 4.6 million, 84 overall. Olafson, ah, oh, he dropped to 84. He is up there in age, so maybe we need to get a new. Maybe we could trade Olafson and Robert Thomas. Just completely make over that second line. Uh, Connor Brown. I kind of like him as a third line, but I'll let him walk for now. McCabe will just get another defenseman at the end of the year. Okay. Well, let's um, 
Advance to free agency. I think I got everyone I cared about. And if someone isn't a part of that, then... Sorry, not sorry. Okay, sure. Same to... Wait, what? All teams must have 50 contracts. Must be at 50 contracts. Currently, I have 39. Oh, what the heck? Well, we're at free agency now. So let's see what's going on here. Wierenski is at the top. And Zadine is up there as well. Shabbat. We have $8.4 million of cap space. And these are the guys available. Okay. Nice. Moritz. Quite a few. But I don't know what uh, what you guys think. I'm sort of thinking we just leave the team as is. Maybe make a trade with Olafsson and um, Robertson. And then we could... I don't know. I don't know. We could sign some free agents, but I'll... Wait for your guys' input on that. So, anyways, disappointing playoff exit yet again. Pretty solid draft, however. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you soon.